we're defending our clients to, to justify why we charge what we charge. We're not charging enough. Right. We're saying, oh, well, they're never going to pay for it. Or, or it's, it's, I, I got this. I heard this. I saw this one. Uh, but the lawnmowers that are be, they're being made, they're made, they're so much easier than they were back in the eighties. You know, it made it, it makes it the job easier. What are yeah. you talking about? It's our time. The time is the same. That's right. The you time know, is the take, same. I used to say, it used to take three guys. I don't remember exactly. I might be a little off, maybe a minute or two or three, but I remember it took three of us. I had a weed whacker an edger. We used a, a, a little wonder. We didn't have the stick edgers back when, you know, when I was younger. Yeah, that's right. We had the little wonder. You're telling your right. age a little bit there, buddy. Careful. Oh, I don't really care. I, I want people to know that they, that, you know, that it's that nothing's really changed, and, and including the prices. And we used to charge twenty five, thirty dollars, thirty five dollars to cut a lawn. That took us ten minutes to cut the lawn. But then that included pulling pulling the tr- the uh, machines off of the truck and beating. And by the way, beating the gate on the street that eventually <laughs> yeah. fell off down the road. Right? I mean, <laughs> yeah, that's right. It, it, Right, it, it, it got it, heavy at the end of the day, didn't it? I'm um, not kidding. It got heavy, and I, I remember you see young that the mesh would fall off. Why is that happening? Because we got tired. We, you know, it beat us up. We're trying to get as listen. I had a whole street. I had a whole street. It was like 25 lawns. We cut. We kicked out 25 lawns in like three hours. We kicked, and maybe even less than that. I remember that was the day. It was a Thursday, and I remember you used to call Thursday, Thursday, Thursday. We still do Thursday, Thursday. We knew that we'd start around. Eight nine o'clock, and we'd be gone. We'd be done for the day, <laughs> done for, at lunchtime because we just kicked out. We just made a lot of money. We thought, yeah, right. That's right. And we took the rest of the day off, and we would just go drinking the rest of the afternoon. It was a lot of fun, you know. Yeah, yeah, that's but, right. But we're still charging the same amount of money as we did back then. Why? The gas prices. They're they're, they're tr- oh, okay. So the, the gas. We know the gas prices at three nineteen. It's, it's equivalent. It's really equivalent to what it cost back then. I mean, if you look at it, you look at this, like they even say it's, it was actually, it was actually cheaper or it was more expensive for gas back in the seventies, the seventies that it is now, if you go back and understand inflation, but, but the, but the cost of to, the, the, the actual dollars that you're spending should be, they should all grow together. The, the cost of a truck. I was looking to buy a new truck the other day. Are you kidding me? I'm going to have to spend a thousand dollars a month just for like an F one fifty. When I need a truck that's going to handle that's going to handle you know a couple tons of something, of material, right? It's dis- it's disgusting, and we're charging the same amount of money. I swear to God, if you I I, I even posted Wayne, and I know, and I'm going to let you take it from here, but I even posted that I believe that it should not you should not open pull the trailer down off of your truck for I don't care how big the lawn is for less than seventy five dollars. I don't I just. In not even knowing what the real cost of of everybody's overhead and everything, right. I don't think seventy five dollars that should be the absolute standard minimum, the minimum industry standard, right there. Well, you know, you're paying. Hey, if a heating and air guy comes to your house, you're paying seventy nine ninety five or eighty nine ninety five for them to show up, and they're showing up with a van and tools. Hell, <laughs> no, I, you know what? I, I you're right. But was, we're willing to show so up for, and, and we'll show up on a bi-weekly basis and mow our brains out and spend a whole lot of extra time for $35, $45. And, you know, I don't want the guys to get hung up on 35 or 45 because I have guys all the time in seminars say, well, I don't mow anything for under 50 Well, right. okay, but you can be just as far off on 50 as you can 35 Exactly. You know? you know, just because you're charging 50 I mean, don't pat yourself on the back yet. Don't you pat yourself on the back. And, you know, that. And God sent me a text just a second ago here, Darren, and it's perfect to the point you made. He says, I'm personally trying to break away from the mentality of consistent comfort of living yeah. on nothing. 